Ed Sheeran has gone and done a move which I don't think anybody saw coming. It was a shock. He has done a collaboration with Pokemon Go, which is very, like, random. It's just like, wait. People still playing that. <laughs> yeah, oh, it's still massive. It is still massive. It's huge. That was amazing back in the day. When everyone was playing it, like, oh, you'd go down yeah. the high street in Bangor and you'd be playing it and it is, like, brand new and... Oh, you walk past, you see everyone else playing it, yeah. and everyone goes to the same poker stops it was to that Pokemon and stuff. Bro, summer, that was amazing. summer 2017 or 2016 yeah. or something like that. It was brilliant. People running around those streets in real life catching Pokemon. Me, that was like a dream come true for young me. <laughs> me, yeah. me and a mutual <laughs> friend that you know really well as well. Um, we yeah. used to go around in his car and like oh, that scumbag. <laughs> oh yeah that guy oh. um, we used to go around in his yeah, car and we used to um, spin poker stops and that and then one time we went to the Premier Inn right um, because there were poker mm. stops there and he reversed straight into the wall and knocked it over and it was it was brilliant and then he drove off and there was nothing said about it because his t- car was built like a tank right. so his car didn't get damaged the wall was knocked no one asked any questions it's still damaged now but anyways so what's Ed Sheeran doing with it? Ed Sheeran um has decided to make this collaboration. His hoodie is for free in the game or something like that. But on this collaboration event, his music will play in the background of Pokemon Go at night or something like that. So instead of the normal background music, it'll be Ed Sheeran songs, I think. And there's all, all, right. all of the water starters are available in the wild with a squirtle with sunglasses. And I'm not sure why. Maybe he really likes water types or something like that um but yeah and it seems to be to promote the new album but at the same time it feels more like a fan move it doesn't feel like ed sheeran gets that much out of this do you know what i mean it feels more like he... well, what's the actual like uh agreement then well like so he puts his song in a game and what he gets money for it or what no no he i'm guessing it's to make people who are playing pokemon go go like Oh, like not that anyone's not heard of Ed Sheeran, oh, but what a tune! What a yeah, tune. people. I, I can download that song. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And then it's his new album. It's to promote his new album coming out. But like I said, yeah, it feels more. Clever. It feels more like a fan move. It doesn't feel like like Ed Sheeran might be a massive fan of Pokemon, and he just did it because he thought oh, it'd be, be sick. it'd be fun. Rather than <laughs> oh, I really want to promote my album. It's like. I know my album is going to sell really well. I'd really like to be in Pokemon Go. Why not? Go if, if Pokemon Go was like at the peak it used to be, like an Ed Sheeran or someone did that, that would really help sales. I don't know how popular Pokemon Go is right now. I feel like it's not as... It's I, not... I feel like the game is better because I think they've just been constantly upgrading it and stuff. Yeah. But from what I've heard, at least. Because at first I remember it was like pretty buggy, but everyone used to play it anyway. Um but yeah, like, I imagine like if you if you heard Ed Sheeran songs all the time in it, that'd be pretty sick. Same, same with I think in Fortnite they do stuff like they previewed the uh, the um the latest Star Wars film. Yeah, in, and they like you heard the Emperor's voice at different points. And in the not game just and that, like that, but they had a they had concerts, live concerts playing in Fortnite, and right. that just reminded me there will be a live Ed Sheeran performance. I think in Pokemon Go at a certain time, and I'm like, ah, what? What in the? <laughs> this is a madness. It's such it's a new. Awesome, guy, right? But I was just gonna say about Pokemon Go, it is still massively popular because they did a la- uh, real life Liverpool tour, in, obviously in Liverpool, and apparently a lot of people attended. Oh, sorry. Like, where where was the Liverpool tour? Uh, it was in a place called um, <laughs> uh, England. In a, right. a little, a small, a small little place called Liverpool. I don't think I mentioned that. And um, right. no, you did. It, it was it was massive. <laughs> apparently, it was massive. So I was like, oh, so it must still be, you know, big. This is a clip from the Fireside Podcast. Check out the full podcast link below. <sighs> the, 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 